the Iowa Hawkeyes with their seventh straight win over the Northwestern Wildcats. They get their seventh win of the Big Ten season and celebrate tonight in Carver Hawkeye Arena. Mike Wolf alongside Brenda Van Langen. And Brenda, this Iowa team, they were short on the bench, mm. didn't have a lot of players available. They're still missing their starting point guard and will for the remainder of the season, but they got a lot of great balance and found a way to win. In a situation where they knew that they would have a couple of players unavailable, it, it was as if everybody on the team knew, I need to step it up. I need to have extra points, extra rebounds in this game. And that's exactly what happened. You had great balance from this team, and they came out with a really strong showing at home tonight. Eight different players had five points or more, and they were led early on by Allie Disterhoff, their senior leader, second all-time in career scoring for the Iowa Hawkeyes. She had 14 in the game. Now you had a lot of different players contributing, but it was Allie Disterhoff who got things going in the first half, driving hard to the basket. You saw the three-pointer earlier, that funky three-point shot that she has from the left wing got things going and then Megan Gustafson was just too much to handle in the second half. They were able to break down the defense and make great passes inside to set her up using her strength, her offensive rebounding ability, put it back in, just stayed with it. Even though she was in foul trouble in the first half, came through in a big way in the second half to finish things off. Gustafson just two boards away from her 14th double-double of the season. Nia Coffey did all she could, 21.7 rebounds. Deary had another good night, a lot of steals for her for Northwestern. However, the difference in the free throws, that is a huge margin for Iowa. And, and so important for Iowa to hit those free throws down the stretch. They want to try to move up. There's a big battle in the middle of the conference. Everybody trying to get that double bye in the Big Ten tournament. Move up to that four position. Iowa takes a step toward that tonight. Iowa is still in the race for that number four spot in the Big Ten. They win it tonight, 78-59 to over the Wildcats.